Another person has tested positive in the French capital. A fifth case has been reported and confirmed. It is the daughter of the Chinese tourist who was recently hospitalized. The health minister said that the woman, in her 30s, had been placed in intensive care. The father, an 80-year-old Chinese tourist who arrived in France last week, is on artificial respiration. It has come to light that two hospitals in Paris initially declined to test him for the coronavirus after he called emergency services. He had a fever, but no other respiratory symptoms at all. Furthermore, he didn't come from Wuhan. He came from a city 350 kilometers north of there. The doctors explained that if hospitals had to take in all patients who had a fever and had come from China, they could become overcapacitated. Since the outbreak became a global concern, calls to emergency services have multiplied. The head of the Paris call center cautions against panicking. We get some ridiculous questions, like, I walked past a Chinese-looking person in the streets and he coughed near me. Should I be worried? Let's say we receive about 100 calls a day about the coronavirus. Only about 10% of them lead to actual medical tests. France has sent its first charter plane to Wuhan to repatriate about 250 French citizens, who will then be quarantined.